I can't wait to touch this water. <laughs> There's a bunch of fishes. And not then, only fishes, yeah. that is like crops, many, many things. Yeah, we saw a stingray this wow. morning as well. They have a few um, baby sharks. Do -do 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 -do, baby shark. Do -do 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 -do. They are babies, but they like me. <laughs> Sometimes they come around the people. That's and the funny thing. Somebody steal our towels from the chairs. They not. I like Latin, but what is that? It's a dog. I'm not sure they said already they can be sharks and things like that on that area right there. Wait, wait, it's okay. Wait, wait, wait. They're not even getting no, 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 no. Isn't this amazing, guys? This is clear water. Those white beaches, white sand, this lighthouse. It's just magnificent. Welcome to Ocean K. American than eating hot dogs right. on the beach. Hello guys, I'm the Ocean Cake. Have a cruise with Emma. It's about time to have some fun guys. Okay guys, so balcony giving you opportunity to enjoy this view even closer. Yes guys, we're gonna start the day today from the comfort of our balcony looking at this beautiful place right here. We are in the private island of Emacy. So baby, what is your what is your impression? Well, of Ocean K is the very first time that we've been here, right? So we're yeah. gonna discover everything, you know, we're gonna so we was able to look at it from upstairs. Mm -hmm. It looks amazing, it looks very beautiful guys. I mean we can see a lot of development mm -hmm. going on. But what do you think, baby? They do so many things here. They're preparing so much stuff here. And I see the beautiful beaches. I see so many things yeah. they already have. And it's beautiful. And it's huge, actually. And I expected it to be so big. So I'm, I'm impressed. We are super curious. And we are about to go explore MSC, private island, ocean. Key. Let's do it. Guys, we're heading from the ship to the island. Yes, guys, you can see it right there. That is our ship right here, MSC Magnificent. But for the very first time ever, we are touching ground on MSC Private oh, Island. Definitely, which is called Ocean Key. Ocean Key or Ocean Key. You know, people call it different names, but it is a beautiful day so far. It's starting to get a little hot, but mm -hmm. the beach is waiting for us. Definitely. And this beautiful island as well. Definitely, guys. We received our room. Uh, some notice about uh, umbrella which you can rent. I think it's about twenty-eight dollars or something like this. Yep. Uh, so we're going out right now to find out how that works because definitely you don't want to spend all day under the sun without having an umbrella. Yeah. And definitely sure. there's a lot of people, so we're gonna see what we're gonna do about. It. Yeah, because we can see there's different areas, there's different beaches. You know, the main one right here by the lighthouse, and other ones we can see other chairs without umbrellas mm -hmm. in in the other side of the island. So we don't know if the umbrella that we're gonna print is gonna be for that one or here. So we're gonna go to information. We're gonna let you know that way you are not confused when you come for the first time to MSC, Ocean K, Ocean Key, however you wanna call it, guys. We've been able to find out a lot of information about this island. For example, the beach, which is the last one on our way, is actually have sharks. Yeah, <laughs> and, yeah. He said don't get close to them because they don't get close to the people. But it sounds kind of scary, I don't know. Yeah, so we got this beach right here that is right in front of the lighthouse. It's one uh -huh. of the most popular areas just because of the lighthouse being there, plus they have their own bar. Uh -huh. There's another beach, I think they call it South Beach. We're gonna go to the map in a little bit and let you know. And then across the bridge, there is the other one. Apparently that one is kind of deep and they said there's not just shark, but sting rates and uh, yeah. different things that he said that they don't get really close to you like that, but there's a lot that can be seen over there for sure. So we're approaching right now to the to the area where the lighthouse is. Is the main beach? Yeah, yeah. You know, we could say because it's the front one and the lighthouse is there. So the way it works, I guess, we're just going to go find a place to, to sit. Mm -hmm. And then we have these tickets you can see right here. That's the ticket we have for our umbrella, it's $29. So at the moment that we're gonna be sitting, somebody gonna be passing by asking us for this. And uh, what you're paying is not for the chair, you're paying for the umbrella itself. Okay. We already found our chairs and it was like, you just come, take your chair and we yep. time somebody come to you and 
you're going to pay for them. Yeah, since we want to walk a little bit, we're going to try to find them first. That way we don't have to worry about that. Mm -hmm. Well, guys, look at our beautiful chip right there. Oh, yeah, it's so beautiful. Yeah, it's MSC Magnifica right in the main area right here. As you can see, guys, the day has officially started and we're going to explore and enjoy this beach, right, baby? Definitely. Yeah. Guys, just look at this water. That's so beautiful. It's amazing. I love that. Yes, guys, the water actually is very clear. You can see, look at that. It's very clean. We can tell we are back in the Bahamas, right, baby? For sure. It, the water reminds me just as beautiful as in the soul. For sure. But I'm enjoying it. It's, it's a beautiful island. I love the beach. I can't wait to see sharks from yeah, the guys, far. That'll be crazy. You can yeah. see it right here, guys, on our right side. Uh, all the chairs and everything all along. I don't know if that's all the chairs they have. Maybe they have more, but... Uh, I'm pretty sure they're supposed to have more just yeah. because there's a lot of people coming on the ship and sometimes it's not one ship at a time, you know? I'm pretty sure baby, all the activities and everything, they have a pretty divided, most likely. I think you were saying there is some areas uh, for sports, something like this, right? Get yeah. Man, or... Yeah, we was reading yesterday and they got like a sport area on the south beach where they're going to yeah. do all the volleyball tournaments and everything. Down here is the main beach, of course, the lighthouse being there. I know they do a party over there, especially sometimes you can come on MSC and they both stay there two days. So during nighttime, they, they have a very good party going on. For us, it's only one day because we're going to be leaving today for sure. <music> Guys, look at this. Again, this is right in front of the lighthouse and you can see just the ocean, right there. Everything is very nice, the water, very pretty. It's early in the morning, the sun is just starting to kick in, but this is looking very beautiful, guys, for sure. It's gonna be a great day. It's honestly, we like a few minutes only on this island, but I'm like, I don't know, in another galaxy, I don't know. It's so beautiful here. It is beautiful. so beautiful. The weather is perfect and I'm definitely enjoying it. Yeah, it is beautiful. We can see in the lighthouse itself, they have a bar as well. I know that's where probably everybody gonna gonna be a stay uh -huh. uh, because they got the bar right there and they have a great view as well so it's gonna be it's gonna be amazing for sure you can see the lighthouse right there actually if you want to climb the lighthouse it's extra cost for that right it's like 30 dollars or it's about 28 dollars a thing for everybody just to climb it all the way up i'm pretty, pretty sure close. yeah i'm pretty sure it's pretty from there but i don't think we're but gonna I climb think that really today. it's worth 20 dollars per person because it's yeah. kind of a little weird i find you can see right here baby you see those lights it's a light skies all yeah. around and also you can see them all the way on the top right there mm -hmm. so i know sometimes the ship uh, I stay here overnight, overnight. and mm -hmm. when they stay here overnight, they, they have like a, a party. Yeah, they have like a beach party at nighttime, mm -hmm. and I can see that's the lights that they utilize. Yeah, I, I think it definitely looks very beautiful. There's a party, all this light. I, I it could be. So we're right now in front of the bar, and I think there is such a nice bar with a nice view um, on the ship, on the water, on the island, and there is a lot of available seats. I think they did a great job of setting this up. I can just imagine when the boat stay overnight. Mm -hmm. How beautiful this gotta be, like oh, right before, sure. right it's... before the night kicking. Yeah, and see the sunset is definitely the something. location of the lighthouse and the bar right beside it, guys. <laughs> that was MSC. That was a great idea. That was a great. That was a great idea. Yeah, guys, we already can see some people rented the jet skis and enjoying their time on the island. Yeah, and they also have um, one of those excursions that you can book if you want. Mm -hmm. It's just those guys that go there, they kind of lead you in jet skis all around the, the island and the most beautiful areas and things like that. Yeah, that's very nice. If that's something you want to do, the only thing that down here, you, there's no such thing as uh, booking excursions outside on the mm -hmm, website mm -hmm. because this is... MSC private island. So all the excursions and everything you want to do, it's, it's got to be directly with them, yeah. Yeah, I know they have catamaran, they have the jet skis, and I think if I'm not mistaken, they go snorkeling to different places. I think so. Yeah, guys, let's continue exploring. Oh, it's so beautiful here. I can't, can't even like describe you guys. The good thing we, is we now head into mm -hmm. the other beach and to see all everything this island has. 
yeah, we want to explore a little bit more. We see they don't have pool or water parks or anything. It's just beach areas, but we want to, you know, kind of look at those. That way we can make a better decision whenever we decide to stay mm -hmm. somewhere. But uh, it is nice, you know, we came out early and I think that's perfect. And actually at 11 o'clock, which is right now maybe 8 or something like this, yeah. at 11 o'clock here, everything from the ship come outside uh, and mm -hmm. all the activities, parties, everything gonna happen here. Yes, because it's 4 of July, guys. So happy Independence Day whenever you are watching this video. Definitely. Happy Independence Day for everybody. And of course, MSC is going to make sure that we have a good time over here, right? For sure, for sure. Look at that. You can see from here, because we're walking on the, we're on the sidewalk right now. Uh -huh. But you can see that's the main beach right there. You see our beautiful ship over there. Uh, I can see right away there's restaurants right here, maybe right across from where we are, so that's good. Oh, it's definitely nice. I was definitely surprised that they don't sell water in plastic containers at all, because mm -hmm. probably because just for the nature is more healthy to use these materials, which are, can be recycled, and this is definitely great. Yeah, I know they have nature one, safe. one other policy, is, it's a green policy, like try to save, you know, and protect the, the seas. Mm -hmm. And probably that's why they're doing it right. Definitely, because it's definitely say it's plate based in package and cap, so it's definitely a nice thing. So guys, behind me, you can see a beach shack, which where you can come and maybe enjoy some food, which is for free. Yeah, they're not open yet, but uh, hopefully around later, probably around 11 or something, they might open. Yeah. And I know all these uh, chairs and tables going to be used for sure. Busy for sure. For sure. <laughs> yeah, but I can see there is still not so much people, honestly. Yeah, I think, I mean, we have all day still early, better for us because we can come around and do all our thing. Yeah. Set up our place early. And uh, people are going to be coming out in a little bit for sure. Yeah, but look at this thing. I can see that there is a lot of trash ca containers, so people don't throw away trash everywhere. Some people like that for sure, I know. Mm -hmm. But as well as you can see here, the DJ, here's the beach and uh, umbrellas, here's the food, there's the rest and like everything's so close. If you need something mm -hmm. like the things must to have around, like everything's so close. Mm -hmm. I definitely like that, you yeah, know, that, that, that you don't is... need to walk a long distance for that. And you already saw they have a bar down there in the back, which is by the lighthouse, but you can see right here, they have another bar, which is very close to the main entrance. You see, let's say that you, don't want to walk all the way to the lighthouse you just come to this bar over here that's right beside the beach shack over there they have seats and everything and you can see the bar right there guys definitely very well set up for sure guys here you can see the whole map of the ocean key and realize where you where you need to go where the noise north island where the south beach uh the restrooms and all of that information yeah, you can see by the name too, the lighthouse, I guess this is where we are right here. On the top they have the Sunset Beach, Paradise Island, South Beach and North Beach kind of connect together. I think maybe you see the Ocean Cay Lagoon? Yeah. And yeah, they have it all divided by names, you know, like the marina and different things. Yeah. I think it's very self-explainable for sure. We can see again, there is a restroom, there is a shop for so with souvenirs so i think there's everything handmade in the bahamas they also have another bar right here this is a big bar as well oh yeah you see do you see behind the bar there is a uh, houses or maybe hotels what is that it's like apartments or something not sure 100 percent you know if they rent this to people okay, so we can see this place right here it's called the smiling fish I guess that's you ice won't cream. believe, but I was reading the name of the ice creams, and instead of smiling fish cone, I read smiling fish cone and tell my goodness, what are we doing for ice cream? <laughs> yeah, you can see right here. I guess this is a place for ice cream. They also have the names as well. They know the prices: nine dollars for the smiling fish cone, waffle cone, seven. Mm, and key uh, lime the ice cream sounds interesting. Key lime ice cream, key lime ice cream. You can see right there, guys. So this is for an extra price, I guess, baby, right? Yeah. Behind us, you see the area which is advertised for the dining. Yeah, it's the main buffet right here, guys. You can see actually the two beaches are right here side by side. Uh, I think it's North and South Beach. Yeah, I'm and I think the buffet is kind of in the middle. Yep. So kind of you can be close the same distance from every beach. Probably yeah. that's why you see a lot of people coming to this side because if you are on the front area where the lighthouse is, all you have is the, the shack area, which yeah. I think they're going to be probably 
selling maybe burgers and things like that. That's what I think. So the main buffet is probably where they're going to have all the menu. And we yes. can see actually they're bringing everything from the ship. So I don't think none of that stay on the island overnight. Yeah, definitely. I would think, I think so. But I would say personally, since we already took the uh, umbrella on the South Beach, I would probably not going to come here again for eating. If I get hungry, i probably just go to the ship, eat and come back. Guys, this area right here is called the Seekers Cove. But you can see how beautiful that lagoon is right there, baby. Yeah, guys, uh, I just don't see there is a DJ, but I see they have also Iberford area uh, and Seekers Family Cove, which you can rent. I don't know, you can rent some stuff here and be, be beach shack as well. And their lagoon kind of look very beautiful. Yeah, that it lagoon looks very, looks very beautiful. And the water color. Morning, morning, how you doing? Good. Good. Like to use umbrella or no? Uh, we good for now. Thank you. Yeah. And uh, as well as they have, it's like this lagoon is a very beautiful color. You see that? Honestly, it looks very calm and chilly. And, and I, I would it. say on this area also, I think the beach chairs are better than the one that we have over there. Uh -huh. Less colorful, but, uh, but these are regular beach chairs. So mm -hmm. that's why probably people that know the island already is coming directly here. But you can see how beautiful that lagoon is, guys. Just look how the area of the lagoon ends and it meets the ocean right there, right in between the rocks. Mm -hmm. That looks very beautiful. Very for sure, beautiful. Guys. I definitely think we should come and touch a piece of this water. Guys, and if you're watching this video, make sure you subscribe, like, and comment our video because we're doing all of these guys for you to share with you what you can do here to see before you go instead of playing here and enjoying all of that. So definitely like and support us. Let's continue our way. This is Ocean K or Ocean Key, private island of MSC, guys. And we are on board of MSC Magnifica. That's the Shelter Cove area. You can see the main driveway over here. And another bar, baby. Oh, yes, there's so bar. many bars. Nice area to be sitting down. You can see the trolley right there coming. The people that don't want to be walking, like Maria and I, walking, walking, walking. Right? Oh, yeah, but I think is this driver is it only for everyone or is it this for one is for everyone. The people that is on the Yash Club. Okay, so have the bigger one. That's yeah, all. they have exclusive, but all of those stations that you see there is gonna be for people that just wanna wait and they're gonna be passing by every certain time. Mm -hmm. Now you see those stations guys right there? Right there? You come, you sit there and you just wait for them to pass by. They regularly gonna be passing by picking you up. Definitely, and it's gonna take yeah. so long. It's like cabanas that you can also rent for an mm -hmm. extra price. I'm not sure how much of the price of those, but uh, you know, you got you see they have it divided by numbers. This is 23, mm -hmm. that's 22, 21. Yeah, I see there's a lot of them, yeah. and I'm pretty sure it's like a few hundred dollars. But this lagoon is just so perfect. Look at that. Oh, yeah. And look looks, how big it is. It's crazy. It is definitely. And you see those places in the middle, like you can swim there. Yeah. That's nice. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? Welcome to Ocean K. Welcome to Ocean K. My name is Joseph. Joseph. I'm Jose. So we're Jose, the same. Yeah, my father's name is Jose. Jose as well? That's good. <laughs> Where are you from, my friend? Sorry? Where are you from? I'm from Philippines. From Philippines. Yeah, okay. Yeah. That's but good. I live here. Live here. Okay. In the island? In the island? Okay. That's good. That's good. All life birds we live here. All right, oh. okay, that's good. So it's not, must be nice, right? Yeah. Okay, that's good. Is those houses close to the ship, uh, like the pink one, purple houses? Yeah, is, house. is that your house? That's where you guys live? Okay, Whoa. that's nice. That's yeah. nice houses, though, you guys. First time here? Yeah, yeah the first time here. On ever. this island, yeah. Maybe we we'll see you again, you know? Yes, yeah, hopefully. Sure. Hope you enjoy this day and hope you enjoy the island. Thank, Thank, you Thank you so much. much. We'll be back. We, we're loving it so far. Thank you so much. Sir. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you. Have a good one. Nice meeting you. Yeah, guys, you can see right here. This lagoon is just amazing. Mm -hmm. Like you can see the water. The water like, here looks so clear. Look honestly, that. it's like being. It looks like there is no deep at all. It's anywhere. like it's like being in the pool. You know. Oh it's, yeah. It's like, guys. Like I don't know. I'm pretty sure I can walk long time, and it's it's not getting deep. This is amazing. No, probably we're gonna come here. I'm telling you. We will have to change. I'm telling you. This is I amazing. love it. It's That's amazing. nice. This is another small, I will say, beach right here. You can see because you have the dividers. Yeah. You say you have the safety net, but it's pretty small actually. It's like hidden from everything. You can see yeah. everything over there, and it's like hidden right here. You see? But I can see that the wave over here 
are a lot bigger. But you can see the safety net in the middle. Uh -huh. I know they have it in all the beaches area. Uh -huh. And I saw that it's very deep. So to kind of mm. probably cover anything from passing by, you know, because that's the open ocean probably. behind Probably, and as you say, there is always uh, on a jet ski patrolling from the sharks because sharks are scared of engine. So... Well, that's a nice little beach right here too. Oh yeah, you mm. want to buy one? Uh, yeah, we're thinking, I guess, the island that this is island, there. Little island. I mean, guys, at the end of the day, our family is not so big, so we definitely can buy, I guess, that small island. Maybe I think we'll be good. Right, you guys, know? let's let's achieve this dream together. That's right. That's why you have to subscribe, give a like, you know, and share this content to everybody. And once we can buy that island, we invite you first to come with us. Oh, right? sure. <laughs> For inauguration day. Baby, I don't know you, but I'm loving it over here. I love it and I'm ready just to go to this lagoon and enjoy it. It's so beautiful, guys. It's so beautiful. Yeah, we're passing the bridge right now. And uh, right here in the beach, I mean, in the bridge area, there's going to be another pool and it's the other side. You can see right here, actually, look. There is the other this. side. I would say the other side is more aggressive. Actually, you can see they have dividers all over the place to yeah. make sure they can close all the areas that is attached to the open ocean. I think that's the, how they cook. Yeah, because I mean, yeah. you see, there are so many uh, dividers. Yeah, that's how they keep uh, the entrance closed for the animals of the ocean. For sure, and I think it's a good thing because you don't, if there is, uh, in this area, is a lot of sharks, for sure. For sure, that's open ocean, but you can see here, yeah, it's just, my goodness, this is beautiful right here. This is beautiful. You see, they also have a divider right there from that lagoon, but it's a small one just to kind of keep the people from crossing over. Yeah, I you think know? so. Guys, we continue. This is Ocean KMSC. And with you guys, Colter Blaine. Yes, guys, we're showing you everything like you was here because our lens is designed to make you feel like you are doing the experience. Definitely, guys. Uh, you can see all that area right there. Yeah, guys, it's closed only for the Yacht Club members. Yep. It is the Ocean House and it's just for the Yacht Club members only, which is an extra membership that you can purchase with MC. Mm -hmm. You know, like a higher class type of thing, right, baby? Definitely. It's the same as well as they have an um, area for them on the Deck 16, I think, right? Yeah, I think so. Whenever we get our private island, we'll be a little bit more welcoming for all of you guys. Okay? <laughs> Let's do it. You see the area right there? That's, for example, if you rent a cabana, you mm -hmm. come over here, you check in, and then you'll be able to uh, go to your cabana, I guess. You see all of that. If you did get your cabana and everything, you come over here, check in. And we can yes, see that. And there's a plenty of beaches, you know? If oh, yeah. you feel like there's a lot of people on one beach, you just go to another one. There's you don't so like many. other one, you go to another one. Uh, you don't want this beach, you want lagoon, go to lagoon. There's two lagoons. So there's yeah. plenty of space for everyone, um, different views, different water, you know, and yeah, definitely def a lot to explore. Definitely not everybody had to be gathered in the same place because yeah. everywhere, guys, is so pretty, so beautiful. You know, we came so early and we got a place right there by the lighthouse. But then when we come over here, we are like, wow, this is amazing. Like, different, yeah. you know, everywhere is just so pretty. Look at this that we're about to see right, right now, guys. Look, this is another oh, yeah. beach. Oh, I think this is the beach that is on open sea, my love. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. I don't and even see dividers. That you can see right there, there's a caution. It's a caution. Say no lifeguards, swim at your own risk. And you can see some of the darker areas as well over there. So that means that that's very deep over there. Oh, yeah. You can see? But honestly, it's not my cho choice will be to stay. What happened here is that at any point of time, anything can happen and they said already there can be sharks and things like that on that area right there that is very deep. You just have to be careful. If you come across the, bee, the bridge and you go to the right side, that beach right there, you are on your own. Okay guys, so we've been walking a long way. Uh, we're going right. towards our, um, towards where we're going, baby. It's about actually, because we've been walking so much and the sun is beautiful, but it's too much. Yeah, it's too so, much. We need some refreshments yeah. and so, probably we're going to take some drinks. Yeah, the good thing is right here, everywhere you walk, you can find a bar. And we're about to go get our first drink right here in Ocean K, private island of MSC. Magnifica. Yes, well, MSC in general, but well, MSC Magnifica is a beautiful chip. Well, yeah. What are you preparing there? Piña colada. Piña colada. Mm -hmm. Is that the most popular thing that you guys do? Of course. What's your name? Costa. Costa from Serbia. Yes. Okay, that's good. That's a piña colada right there that Costa is preparing, guys. Look at that. 
Look at that. In the Philippines, and what's your name? April. Okay, say people to come to Ocean Gate. Hello, guys. Come to Ocean Gate. Have a cruise with us. Great. <laughs> And our man right here, Land, right? Where you where you from? From Santa Lucia. Okay, so you come from nice places, beautiful places too. Paradise. There you go. I changed the name to Paradise Myself. Paradise Myself. I believe it's a beautiful place. That's our strawberry dye kitty, guys, that is being made right there by our friend Lance. Getting us set up the right way. There you go. Nice, smooth, and strong. There you go. Great, this one, brother. All right, thank you so much, Mama. We took two frozen strawberry day kiri, which yeah. is um, without a tax, I think it's $10, right? Yeah. yeah, we took it right here on the bar that is right across from the lagoon, mm -hmm. you know? And this is the, uh, if I'm not mistaken, the shelter cove over here. So they set us off real good because it's hot, guys, and we're just walking oh, yeah, all over definitely. the place. Yeah, and let's I enjoy was. our strawberry day kiri. Here's to you guys. All right, guys, we back to our first place, right, baby? Definitely, guys. We're on the uh, South Beach where we come back. We're probably going to go sleep here, uh, spend a few minutes yeah. here, and then we're definitely going to go to this lagoon. Look at this right here. It's only 11 o'clock, so we have still like six hours to enjoy this mm -hmm. place. That, that water is so beautiful and i guess it's time for us to have some fun after a good drink a good walk all around the area mm -hmm. so it's about time to have some fun guys guys and just let me go inside the water uh kind of drive you a little bit to kind of show you how clean this water is look that's my feet right there you can see it you can see how clean the water is white sand not rocky at all look at that Okay guys, we here on the beach and we found a lot of fish. Yes guys, right here, right in the corner area where all the rocks are, mm -hmm. there's a bunch of fishes. And not there. only yeah. fishes, that is like crops, many, many things. Yeah, we saw a stingray this wow. morning as well. It's been hiding, but we saw it earlier. And guys, it is uh, very nice. It's something different for sure. Mm -hmm. what's going on we continue right here enjoying the day at ocean k definitely guys the series on the side where there's a lot of fishes it definitely was so beautiful it almost the same like we took free snorkeling tour oh yeah there's a bunch of different type of fishes right there guys you're gonna see the footage on the video mm -hmm. they all over i mean they're very friendly they come around you but they don't touch you or bite yeah. you or anything but uh, they're very pretty it was like yellow and it was a man, it was many. Yeah, yeah, it was very beautiful. But I think we're definitely gonna go to the lagoon to check on the baby sharks. Not um, just that, we know on that side it's also the buffet, so... Okay, I see somebody you know, hungry. You no, know, we gotta try the food in the island, which I'm pretty sure is probably the same one that they have I over there. I think so, I think yeah. so. It doesn't get any better than this, look at that. You got the ship right there, look at the colors in the water. It's just, it's just amazing, guys. It is. Guys, right here on the beach right now, and they got a hot dog competition, baby. Uh-huh, guys, let's see what that about, because yeah, I see, I don't know. We can see from here, I think. It's like all you can eat, oh, wow. hot dog. But put the water on the bread. It softens up. Well, pretty much free food. <laughs> it's, if it's free, eat for three. That's exactly what it is. It's as American as apple pie. As American as pretty good pie. Hi, he's so high. Don't get wrong. He was behind the table while you were all watching. <laughs> he was just hungry. He was just hungry. He was just hungry. He was just hungry. So we have a winner.
doing this competition? What is the craziest thing you've seen people do? The people competing, we had some quiet people, then we had somebody, she was talking, she was and going. But I saw a trick she, she was doing though. She was putting water into the, she into was the bread. Water, so that is to, a professional technique. To make it a little bit softer. You've seen a Joey Joss chestnut <laughs> doing. You've seen Kobayashi, yeah. Eater X, Black so Widow. Know, she, 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 came, she knew what she was doing. She <laughs> knew, she was a low key professional, and she was talking, so she's getting the heads in of their competitors. Head. Exactly. So she was playing 3D chess. She slowed gonna... down yeah. just so they could catch up. <laughs> that is a mark of not only professional, but somebody that has done this before. She's not new to this, she's yeah. true to this. Yeah. And it's on the 4th of July, the most American holiday. What's more American than eating hot dogs You're right. on the beach? <laughs> nice meeting you, you are again. Uh, I'm Gene McGee in the place. What part of the United States? So right now, I live in Orlando, Florida, but I'm from Stone Mountain, Georgia. Okay, and Georgia. And I'm okay. currently the only American crew on Magnifica at this point. In time. Oh, wow, that's yeah, good. The American here that's representing. Good. Where are we from? Where are you from? I'm from the American Republic. Yeah, and I'm from Russia, but we live in the United States. Oh, we live in the United Dominican States. Republic. Yep. Uh, hola, and Priviet. Hey, you got, you got this, you got this. You got this. Yeah. Yeah. MSC welcomes everybody, everybody, yeah. everybody around the world. The world comes together on MSC. Yeah. The last time the world came together was Pokemon Go. Pokemon Go. <laughs> now, I tell you, you're right. And now yeah. MSC. <laughs> MSC Magnifica, the world comes together to live, laugh, and love. There you go. Nice meeting you, nice You as meet well. You. Thank you so uh, much. So, guys, this is the beach shack and we see they have cheeseburger hot dog french fries pasta salad they also have brownies as well baby baby and in case you will need a ketchup you don't have to take any ketchup but i will go get that ketchup very soon yeah. maria oh. maria is burning i put my chair on because guys the sun is not playing but still i gotta get me a hot dog right here guys what i saw that they close at 2 30 so that's way earlier than the time that we actually have to come back to the oh, to the chip i'm not sure Okay, baby, so you have, um, baby, but I thought you don't have to take ketchup, do you see? I know, I know you're getting ready now, but no, that's what they got. This is what I got, just a, a, a hot dog. I don't yeah. want to get so full because we want to go to the to the buffet as well. Yeah. But I'm going to try this, guys. And remember, if you don't want to walk all the way to the buffet, come to the beach shack and get something with them. It was the first day in the port. I don't want that. Uh, you don't want that? No. Uh, it's first time we in the port and I didn't bring anything to cover me just because, uh, I don't know, I, I didn't saw it will be so bad. Like, the sun is insane. crazy so. here. And honestly, maybe if I would say only in water, it would be fine, but walking and recording and everything, uh, uh, uh. The sun, yeah. I mean, it's a beautiful day. Crazy. But it's just the sun is it's it's in another strong. level, guys. It's very it's strong. very strong. Okay, let me try something. Oh, no, see. not French fries. Mm. Yeah, I good one. Good one. Look at that. Yay. Eating my hot dog. Mm. From the beach shack. <laughs> She's very scared because we right now in the trolley. <laughs> yeah. 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 That's funny, so but anyway, we just got off the ship. Actually, we went to the ship to eat, right? Yeah, guys, we went to the ship because it's there is buffet, but I remember in Coca it was kind of hot to eat on the side, yeah. which I didn't want it. Plus, I wanted to take the uh, jacket because my skin is burning. Ocean K, it is a nice day right here with MSC, guys. Definitely, guys. Coming down here in the trolley is a lot better than all the oh, work yeah, we did faster, earlier today, definitely. right? Because who was walking so much this morning? It got so hot and we actually needed to get a drink at that point too because it was so hot. Yeah, because it was so hot moving around from one yeah. place to other. Uh, it's kind of not so small island, honestly. Yes, baby. But we're ready to go to the lagoon to see little baby sharks. Mm, yes, guys. And we can tell you actually when we came early this morning, it was a lot better for us to move around. Now we can see there's a lot more people already. But this is what we got right here. You see, that's the South Beach area. And... Uh, big shacks all over the place over there you see all the birds and everything and maria on her way to see baby sharks oh my god maria want to go to the lagoon so bad let's go guys i am just chilling i'm enjoying here but honestly i would say be not i like lagoon but i would prefer the first beach we choose what do you think i mean it's good it depends it's different only thing is that right here you can't really see 100% everything. 
-hmm. You know? What's in the water? Um, and we know there's a few sharks. It is a little, it's, <laughs> and it's a little, little bit smell like fish. I, don't, I, I just don't like the smell. Yeah, it's different. I would say the water in the main beach over there is a lot cleaner. Mm -hmm. It's uh, way more clear as well. Mm -hmm. You can see more everything. And uh, that gives you a little bit of a sense of... Um, a sense of uh, safety, mm -hmm. safety, mm -hmm. I would say. Yeah. But it's very good. I would say the the water itself feels very good, guys. The yeah, temperature I would say so. of the general, water. The island, this island, I'm, I'm impressed. I, I really yeah. like that. Yeah, it is very beautiful. Uh, they have so much space over here. You see all around, all of the, all that area right there. You can see all the way in the far over there, down here. All of those are seats that are not being used. Yeah. All the way down there as well. All the way down here. And then you have the main beach over there. And there's more other, more, more other areas for the beach as well. So definitely, our ship, if I'm not mistaken, is about 3,000 people, something yeah. like that. Yeah. I don't think... Um, I mean, they have too much space. They can definitely bring oh, yeah. two or three chips yeah. here at because the same you time. Know, wherever you go here, you don't feel like overwhelmed or like in line. So I'm pretty sure with two chips, we would be better to find here too. And that's what we have for now. We had the opportunity to come in with MSC Magnifica, mm -hmm. and it oh, was a Magnifica experience. Mm -hmm. And Ocean Cave for the first time has been Magnifica as well. Oh, definitely. You know, and really uh, enjoying, guys. it's been a great trip, guys. I honestly don't really understand all these bad reviews um, MSC have because honestly, yeah, our the food experience was so far good. Um, our experience has been great. Was so far good. Honestly. Yeah, our experience has been has been great. Honestly, uh, yeah. again, everybody talk about their experience. Our about our experience. Uh, it has been awesome. I, I don't, I don't really understand the bad news. Yeah, I mean, again, hopefully, if you decide to book with MSC, it doesn't go too bad for you. Because for us, it has been awesome. We, yeah. you know we based on this trip because we might go again in another one and go through so bad experience based on this this trip which is the first one that we ever do and first is impression always come based on this trip we will definitely recommend to anybody to go to the yes. it was it was great it's a great choice if you mm -hmm. if you guys want to switch it up a little bit or want to try something different uh like we did you know we've been uh, traveling in Royal caribbean great experience yeah. everything great we decided to switch it up a little bit and uh it came out to be very good for us actually definitely i really don't care about the tower it's just uh, make me mad it's like what did you do mm -hmm. because they didn't blow anywhere somebody took it yeah 100 i know somebody took it or whatever it is. <laughs> Why would you go and take towers from somebody else? I just want to share stuff somebody else. Hmm? We share stuff. That's the only thing I want to say. Wow. Okay, guys, and just like this, we came to the end of our video. Yes, guys, this was Ocean K, the private island of, of MSC. And remember, we, we've been going on MSC Magnifica. And guys, first time ever that we visited this magical, beautiful place, guys. Definitely, guys. We had a great experience. We loved it. We enjoyed it. We're definitely going to come back and see how much it changed because it's definitely gonna change uh, in a year a lot. Yeah, there is a lot going on. We know it's gonna be different. If you by any chance are considering going on an MSC cruise, make sure that in your itinerary, one of the stops is at the Ocean K Marine Reserve. Mm -hmm. You're gonna love it. It's a chill day. It's just go to the water, just relax just, just enjoy enjoy. You know? enjoy the nature just enjoy they have activities for you here and there you know there's still room to improve but just enjoy you know Definitely. just love like we did we came we've been working for seven days so hit that subscribe button guys oh yeah you know and give us a like if you like what we're doing we have a lot of content for you but today we just relax right baby definitely guys but still we wanted to make sure we are doing a great content for you guys and we're always trying to do better and improve everything we do so please just um 
give us a like give us a like even if you don't subscribe at least give us a like because we definitely uh trying our best to make a good content for yes, you yes guys all the growing that we've been seeing on our channel is because of you guys watching and uh you know giving the likes and sharing the content really appreciate that yeah we, you know, it's very important for us yeah and if you are it's like new, um a feedback of you that you like in our content and yeah. it driving us you know driving our improvement yeah for sure and if you are new to the channel and you already fell in love with us hit the subscribe button you know so youtube can let you know when we have something new and if you all to the channel and you continue with us thank you so much because of you we are here and we're mm -hmm. gonna continue doing so much more right baby definitely guys guys yeah. come and enjoy this beautiful place definitely and thank you for watching this video yes guys and remember this was ocean Okay. And culture blend. See you next time. I actually forgot to mention somebody steal our towels from the chairs which we bought in the Nassau. So somebody steal my memory and mucho bobo. I hope they enjoy it. How do you enjoy my towels?